I give the call to the member for Monash. Deputy Speaker, thank you for the call. Another dose of Monash common sense from Russell Broadbent. One thing that I've always um, held up very high as, a, as the member for Monash and formerly Macmillan and, and Coronella before that was it that I had a duty of care, not only to the people that I represent locally, but to the nation. We, as parliamentary representatives, I think come in here, and I have the greatest respect for every member of parliament that comes into this place with a view to putting Australians first in the best interests and a duty of care towards those. And in that process of duty of care, have you ever thought for a minute why there isn't already a nuclear plant here in Australia? Well, we have one, but I mean a, a major power plant. One very good reason, because we have an abundance of natural resources in coal and gas. And how dare it be written in one of the newspapers that I read on the weekend that coal is the cheapest form of electricity. And it powerfully grew the Hunter Valley. It powerfully grew La Trobe Valley that gave Victoria the abundance of cheap power. We have so much gas underground in Victoria, it's nearly bubbling to the top by itself. But there's a moratorium in Victoria that says we lack common sense. We are going to cut both our hands off in regards to energy. So we can't use these amazing natural resources that we have. If we don't address it and have this duty of care towards the Australian people, we are going to end up having what they call, um, not brownouts, but we're running out of power in some spots, so we just switch off Bendigo for a while, or we take the biggest business we can find and tell them you're going to have to curtail what you're using at the moment. We're going to have to cut your gas down for a while so you won't be able to operate that day. Can, can you agree with that? I love to speak in the moment because my wife had a day this week without power and she went through all the issues. But I said, look, I've got this fantastic um, battery uh, boiler that'll, that'll you can put onto the car, six volt battery, put it and boil yourself a cup of coffee. Well, it would work, but it took an hour and a half to boil. I mean, there are restrictions on other alternative methods of getting something boiled. And electricity is when we boil water and put it through. And what's the damning part? Where people attack us, what they do, they come along and say, look at this pollution in the Trobe Valley. And they show a picture of steam coming off the cooling towers. Yes, you can see the smokestacks as well. But what we need to do desperately is make sure that those coal-fired power plants in and around my electorate are still there and pumping away. We've got to put energy and exercise into looking after those power plants.